Oh, these bees are so helpful. I know. Maybe I can help do up their hair. Oh, wait. I can't do that. I don't remember where I put the honeycomb. To meet your match. Uh, Stoppy, what are you doing? Oh, I'm gonna get rid of these bugs once and for all. They are too much of a dangerous to our glorious plants. Oh, uh, wait, you can't do that. Why not? These are bugs that are gonna eat our plants. Uh, those aren't just any bugs, those are pollinators. What? Oh. They help plants and vegetables grow. Wait a second. Are you talking about bees? Well, them too. Bees, bats, butterflies, beetles, even flies are pollinators. So they just fly around with all that pollen and then, well, and then what? Then do they just, they just grow? Kind of. In some cases, the wind and rain blows pollen between plants. But really, most plants need bees and other pollinators to take the pollen from plant to plant. First, the pollinator finds a plant that has sugar or nectar. Pollen from the flower's anthers drops onto the pollinator. As the pollinator flies from plant to plant and flower to flower, it drops off some of that pollen and it sticks to the stigma and fertilizes the plant. This is why pollinators are so important, because they help make the plants grow. So, if I chop all these bugs, then the plants won't grow. Right! We need all the pollinators we can get! I know. Maybe we can talk to Auntie and she can tell us more. Pollinators are very, very important as a florist, but also to my Pueblo people, which are from Acma and Laguna, because they help um, in fertilizing our crops. So you have pollinators such as bees, butterflies, dragonflies. And when they go from various flower to flower on these plants, they have these little hairs on them and the pollen sticks to them. So when they fly from flower to flower, they spread that pollen to all the different plants. And that's what helps these plants grow and nurture so that they become food for our people. But one cool, interesting thing about pollinators, did you know bats are also pollinators? So the plants that come out at night or sometimes bloom at night, because in the desert, we have plants that, that bloom at night, the bats will actually help the nighttime plants as well. I didn't know how important pollinators are. And they're so cute. And helpful. Yes, and snuggly, just buzzing away, making plants. I think we should take them home. Uh, I don't think mom would like that very much. Oh, I just want to snuggle with them a little bit. I think we have to stay outside. Okay. Don't worry, little guys. We'll find a place to snuggle. Oh, Stompy.